I have fantastic news I want to share with you. In today's conversation, I want to talk to you about a $50,000 unified federal credit union personal loan with FICO as low as 545. You're going to love today's conversation. I guarantee it. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sort of Kiwi Show. How are you today? I hope you're all doing fantastic. I'm doing marvelous, if you're to ask me. If you are doing as great as I am, go grab a cup of coffee or tea or vodka and let's roll. <laughs> In today's conversation, I want to speak to you about a personal loan, a massive personal loan from Unified Federal Credit Union, maximum loan amount $50,000. And the FICO minimum is 545. Before I get into the actual nitty gritty, please understand that this is this video is purely educational. We have no affiliation with uh, Unified Federal Credit Union. They have not paid us for this video. We're just trying to share with you information we have gathered after months of research. Let's talk about the loan overview. So here you have a personal loan. This is a personal loan. So you can actually the rates go as low as a 3.49% APR for a 12 month term. The loan amounts will go from $500 to 50 grain and additional rates available from 12 to 84 month terms. So if you want to have a lower APR, you want to go for a lower term, less than 12 months. If you want, let's say you want to go, you want to look, you're looking for a loan for three months, I mean, three years, four years or five years, then you might be paying something, an APR in the double digit, in the lower double digits. But the cool thing here is that the maturity of the loan can go all the way to seven years, 84 months, okay? And so you have a, a debt consolidation loan. You can use the loan for a debt consolidation plan. So you can combine multiple loan payments into one simple loan to reduce debt and save money. And for that, you have a rate as low as 8.74% APR, Loan amount, same thing, $500 to uh, $50,000. But again, this loan can be a debt consolidation loan or just a regular loan. If you need the loan for, let's say you have to make a big purchase, you have to move out, you have to take care of some emergency in the family, or you just need cash. If cash is tight, you can use this loan to sort of uh, fill the gap or, or temporarily, right? You can also have a Unify personal, uh, Unify Federal Credit Union also offers a signature line of credit. And this is kind of cool because, uh, and this is unsecured, so you don't, have, you don't have to pledge any collateral for it. You can use the cash for repairs, cash shortfalls, and any unexpected expenses with a revolving line of credit. And the amount here, $1,500 all the way to 50000 low variable rates, low minimum payments. You only pay interest on the amount used, and you can take advantage of a 25% rate discount when you have auto pay. Let me talk to you about other loans that uh, Unify Federal Credit Union offers. And this is kind of cool because you want to have an idea just in case you don't qualify for the main loan. You can qualify for other loans. Folks, in this show, I'm still talking to you about a massive personal loan from Unify Federal Credit Union. Maximum loan amount, $50,000. If you have a FICO as low as 545, you can qualify. Not a problem. So what are the other loans that Unify has for you? They have short-term loans, they have vehicle loans, they have home loans. Let, let's quickly go through those loans. In our experience, we have seen that uh, the uh, approval rate for the short-term loans is extraordinarily high. The only thing is the amounts are low. <laughs> there is, it's a very low. So with short-term loans, you can get funded fast and repay quickly. So if you are a Unified member in good standing for at least 90 days and you have no outstanding or delinquent Unify short-term loans, you may qualify for a short-term loan to cover your emergency and they can bridge your funds until payday or provide a quick loan without excessive rates or fees. So basically what it is, is you are using this money as a payday loan. It's just that it's not coming from those uh, quote unquote uh, dodgy lenders, payday lenders. It's coming from a, a respectable, a prestigious institution such as a Unify. Okay. So for the quick loan, you have 0% interest. It's uh, like a payday loan without excessive rates or fees. You pay 
You can use it for unexpected expenses, emergencies or bills. The amount options, very, very low, very low. <laughs> so they can lend you 300, 400 or 500 dollars. You do have a $20 non-refundable application fee. You can repay the loan in six weekly payments starting 30 days after funding. No credit check. They also have a credit rebuilder loan, not a credit builder loan, a credit rebuilder loan. So you can use that to rebuild or establish credit. Loan amounts $200 to $1,000. You have a $20 non-refundable application fee and you have a 2% rebate of uh, original balance if payments are made on time and you have they have a free credit counseling service offered alongside this credit rebuilder loan. In terms of uh, vehicle loans, they have auto loans. You can get up to 100% uh, financing terms up to eight years. You can enjoy low fixed rates for new used or refinanced cars. They also have motorcycle loans. You can get up to 100% financing also terms up to six years. And they have boat loans. They have RV loans. They have home loans, mortgages. So this is great. When it comes to home loans, they do offer a constellation of loans. They have fixed rate first mortgage loans, adjustable rate first mortgage, flex rate home equity line of credit, home equity loans, low down payment home buyers program. They have a down payment second mortgage helper loans and they have a realtor rebate program loans. Let's talk about eligibility, folks. I'm still having a conversation with you about a huge personal loan from Unify Federal Credit Union, maximum loan amount $50,000. Pretty cool, right? And uh, if you have a FICO score going as low as 545, you can qualify. So what is what are the rules for eligibility for this loan? First of all, you got to be a member of the Federal Credit Union of this Unify. You got to be 21 years old, at least. Minimum income, $24,000 a year. That's two grand a month. And that's gross income. That's pre-tax income. You got to be a U.S. citizen or a green card holder. If you are a foreigner, you can still qualify, but you need to have an ITIN. You got to have an individual tax identification number. And uh, you got to be, of course, an account holder with Unify, even if you're a foreigner. The FICO score minimum, I've said it before, this is 545. And Unify might require employer references. And in terms of employment accepted, they will accept you if you are a full-time, part-time, seasonal worker or temporary worker. As long as you can qualify at the income level, in other words, if all the, if the um, aggregation of your sources of income amount to $24,000 pre-tax income, at least that amount, then you can qualify. Not a big deal. Let's talk about the membership. This credit union is open to anyone. So there is no restriction in terms of geography, in terms of uh, profession, in terms of family affiliation in terms of anything okay and you can see on the screen here it says a pretty it, it says it very very clearly that all you need to qualify to qualify for a membership is just to uh, be 21 years old you need to um, you need to provide your uh, your ids and that's it so unify connects members coast to coast not a problem and you need to have your social security or itin you need to have a current government id or state ID or driver's license. You need to fund your new Unify account, okay? So you'll need to provide a bank routing account number or a valid credit card or debit card. And you must be a US citizen or a permanent US resident or a someone who holds a, a, valid, uh, a, a valid visa, okay? That's just all it is. Let's talk a little bit about Unify accounts. Folks, in today's conversation, I am talking to you about a massive personal loan from Unify Federal Credit Union. We are speaking about a loan whose uh, maximum amount is $50,000. Minimum loan amount, 500. If you have a FICO score as low as 545, you can qualify, not a problem. So if you wanna increase your chances of uh, getting the loan, especially if you have poor credit, it's important to have uh, one or two or even three asset accounts with Unify. And this is what we call on this show, MPR. You need to establish a multi-product relationship with Unify so you can boost your odds of approval. 
it's not mandatory, but it's highly recommended based on our research, based on the clients that we have advised, based on our own experience, based on the inside information we have had with uh, Unified Federal Credit Union and other credit unions over several years. So when it comes to uh, having accounts with Unify, you have uh, a plethora of accounts. They have savings accounts, they have uh, checking accounts, they have uh, investments products, they have insurance products. Let's quickly go through this. First, let's talk about the savings accounts. With uh, Unify, you can actually uh, open a regular savings account, an e-savings account, a special savings account, a club account, a money market account, a share certificate account, a traditional IRA, a Roth IRA, a savings IRA, or a Coverdale education savings account and ESA. The choice is yours. Okay, and the cool thing here is that with the savings accounts from Unify, you get unparalleled access to your funds combined with direct deposit and an ATM card. What about the checking accounts? You have you can have a free checking account. You can have an e checking account. You can open a premier checking account or you can have the right start checking accounts. I love this name, by the way. <laughs> okay, so you can see on the screen here. They also have a Unify checking accounts. So this is a, a recap of the Unify checking accounts. I want you to see on the screen right now. We're showing you a recap of Unify checking accounts. Let's move on now to investments. With Unify, you have uh, you can actually uh, get the 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 help you need in terms of uh, investment accounts. They do have investment services that include uh, full financial planning and analysis, retirement planning, estate planning, education savings planning mutual funds, annuities, IRAs, stocks, and bonds. They can also help you in terms of insurance. So you can see here that if you are interested in having in buying insurance through Unify, they can take care of you in terms of uh, auto insurance, home insurance, renter's insurance, accidental death and dismemberment insurance, mechanical breakdown protection, and debt protection. I'll be right back, but after this, don't go anywhere. Welcome back, folks, to another section of the Awesome Sort of Kiwi Show. We are still having a conversation today about a huge personal loan from Unify Federal Credit Union. Maximum loan amount, $50,000 minimum, $500. And uh, if you have a, a FICO score as low as 545, you can qualify for approval. Let's talk about getting prepared. So the cool thing here is that you want to increase your chances of getting the loan, right? I will, I will show you step by step the things you need to do to boost your chances. So first of all, right off the bat, and I've already said it, you need to be a member of Unify. No restriction there. Next, you need to gather your pay stubs. So you need to, because Unify will want to verify your employment. They want to verify your income. So you want to gather your pay stubs, you gather your W-2s, your 1099s. You can gather this electronically or in paper format, not a problem. Then you want to gather your tax returns for the last three years. If you have them for the last two years, it's okay, but they want to have, they want to see at least three years. So this could be a 1040. And if you have a business on the side, you can also add your business tax returns. Let's say you're just running an LLC or, or LP or C Corp or S Corp on the side. You can add to your 1040. You can add your 1120 S or C or your 1065. Not a problem. Next, you want to gather your bank statements for the last three months. If you bank already with uh, Unify, then it's okay. If not, they will want to have bank statements. They also want to have your PFS. PFS stands for personal financial statements. So they will want to have your personal balance sheet, your personal income statements, and your personal cash flow statements. Personal balance sheet is the same. When you hear the terms balance sheet, statement of financial condition, statement of financial position, those terms are interchangeable. They mean the same thing. And uh, if you are a sole proprietorship, if you want to, uh, let's say you want to apply as, let's say, as a business slash individual, extra documents might be needed. But again, you have to talk to uh, Unify for that. 
and they might also want to have an idea about your housing situation do you rent or do you own and if you do you have to specify exactly that and you might have to uh, add more uh, documentation to your uh, to your application now let's talk about contacting unified this is very important because uh, once you have done all that you need to contact a banker at Unify. Folks, I'm speaking to you, I'm still speaking to you about a superb personal loan from a Unify Federal Credit Union, maximum loan amount $50,000, minimum $500. If you have a FICO as low as uh, 545, you can qualify, not a problem, okay? And what I wanna say here is that, why do you need to contact Unify? For several reasons. If you wanna boost your chances of getting approved, Let's say you have bad credit or you need more information. You want to get a soft pull before getting a hard pull, for example. You want to contact them. You also want to have more information about the loan, right? I mean, because here I'm giving you the basics. I'm giving you as much details about the loan as possible, but you might want to contact them directly to have a clear idea of the uh, ins and outs of the loan. You get just, you want to pre get prepared to discuss your loan. What do you need to have ready? I already said that you need to have everything ready in terms of pay stubs, tax returns, bank statements, financial statements, all that kind of stuff. And uh, when it comes to contacting Unify, you have several ways of doing it. You can contact them through their toll free number 1-877-254-9328. They are available 24 seven folks. So you can contact them again. The number is 877-254-9328 or the number, the local number is a 310 381 2300 they are they also have uh, an automated telephone banking available 24 7 one 347 2837 and if you are outside the united states you can contact the direct number 303-967-1096 i want to say also that you can contact them you can go to the nearest branch if you are lucky enough to live uh, in california they are based in torrance in the beautiful beautiful city of uh, Torrance, California. All right, so you can contact them there. You can actually even uh, talk to them online. They have live chat features on their website. They also have the e-banking where you, you just need to log in into your account and send them a secure message. If you want to contact them uh, via mail, the address is uh, Unify Financial Credit Union, not Federal Credit Union, Financial Credit Union. I've been saying Federal Credit Union, but it's Financial Credit Union. And the number is, uh, I mean, the address is 1899 Western Way, Torrance, California, 90501. And uh, one thing I want to say to finish here is you can even email them. The cool thing here is you can email the general number, the general, um, yeah, the general staff at unify at unifyfcu.com. Or you can even email the CEO, Gordon Howe. And the email is president at unifyfcu.com. Now let's talk about the application, the application here, folks. Folks, I'm still talking to you about a massive personal loan from Unify Federal, not Federal, Unify Financial Credit Union, maximum loan amount $50,000. Minimum $500. If you have a FICO as low as $545, they'll take care of you. So you can con you can actually apply at the branch via email, via mail. If you receive an offer in the mail, you can apply over the phone or online. And if you are already a member, you can actually um, log into your account and apply from there. And if you are a member, you want to apply online to speed things up, just have your unified member number, your social security number, your monthly housing payments, your employment information and income. If you're not yet a member, not a problem. They still want to know, want to have your social security number, your monthly housing payments, and your employment information and income. Let's look here on the screen. So here, this is how things look like. So first, they want you to look to read some disclosure statements. Okay, you just have to agree to uh, go through the process, and then you have to click, I agree, I accept to continue. And you need to hit the loan that you're looking for. So you need to uh, hit 
personal loan click on personal loan see you see automobile recreational home landing credit card personal loans all this kind of stuff right short-term loan click personal loans next here you have a personal loan signature line of credit debt consolidation right we're going to choose personal loan so click get started and basically they're asking you if you are already a unified member we're not so we're going to put no and you have to click you have to continue and they want you to this is uh, more the USA Patriot Act. this is more regulatory just click continue and here they want to have your personal information so put your first name last name your social and your date of birth and uh, you have to include your whether you are a US citizen or not next you want to put your the ID type you want to upload the number the state the issue date, expiration date very basic number very basic information rather you want to put your address your zip your city everything then you want to put your contact information your email your phone number whether it is a phone number the home number or cell phone click continue in this case you can add a co-borrower if you want to but if not just click continue and here they are going they are giving you a warning that you know you're going to have a hard pull you can just click no but in this case we will say yes just to continue with the uh, with the process if you're not ready to get a hard pull don't do don't do it if not if yes just go ahead and click yes and here they're asking you how much you're looking to borrow you put the amount you want to borrow why you need the money put your income your employment status and when you started working at the company and they want to have more information about your employment status your occupation your employer and the address your business address your employer employer's address you can add additional income if you want to if not just click continue and here you want to put the address okay we had to blur this out because we need we, we had to use an actual address we were trying to use a fictitious address but the system unify system is so good they were blocking us out so we had to use a real one so you got to click continue in terms of monthly payments your uh, and here they are there are, you have to choose the option that best suits your needs so you have term loans okay we selected the lowest payments so the seven seven ninety nine dollars a month and here you just have to uh you just have to click see you later and that's it all right folks this is it for today's conversation i was talking to you about a fifty thousand dollars unified fcu personal loan i gave you a loan overview spoke to you about other loans eligibility criteria unify accounts getting prepared how to contact unify and what to talk what to talk to them about and the application process thank you so much for your attention i really appreciate it i will see you next time but until then remember stay marvelous